four-piece set out of Kansas City, Missouri. They can be compared to bands such as Flyleaf, Thursday, and Alkaline Trio. Even though they are a female-fronted band, they don't see themselves any different from other bands in the business. When asked if it's tough being a female vocalist, they responded. Yeah, she's been a girl for her whole life, so, you know, uh, can't really do anything about that. But no, most kids are really receptive to the difference of how a woman has a problem as opposed to like a guy. So we don't really see that much difference. I think people are, people are kind of freaked out that she screams better than most dudes that we know. So, you know, that's, that's kind of it. So, what should you expect if you buy Flee the Scenes album? Um, if you haven't heard our record, uh, you can probably just expect like, The Rock. The Rock. <laughs> Bringing the rock and roll. It's the feel-good album of the year. That's right. It's definitively. Um, you'll probably just expect diversity. We, you know, we go from being really, really heavy to being really straight head rock and roll, and just kind of like all points in between. So really, you know, take from the hardcore all the way over to indie rock and kind of all together. So you're not really going to hear the same thing over and over. Keep touching my hips, leg, knees, leg. Uh, so you're going to hear a lot of the diversity, and then you'll hear guy-girl vocals, so you'll 